Yo, what up? Peace and blessing to the fam. This is your big homie, Jed. You're rocking with the Retro Insider YouTube channel. As always, thank you for checking out the content. Go ahead and hit that like button for me, please. And if you are new, hit that subscribe button as well so you can be notified every time I drop a video. And there will be plenty coming because as you can see, I got some boxes. And today we're going to be looking at a package delivered from Hibbit Sports. We got this made in the U.S. New Balance. Now, as it is close to uh, Black Friday, a lot of the online retailers are offering great deals on some of their stock. So I was able to get this shoe for under 80 bucks and we're gonna check it out right now. So um, I'm always a huge fan of New Balance. This is probably like my eighth or ninth pair of New Balance 998s and it's my favorite silhouette. And as you can see, it's the M998TCC. Now, the reason I like New Balance, not only is it quality, but the comfort. As a guy who has a big foot, a wide, heavy body, I like New Balance. They don't have narrow shoes like Nike and Adidas. And wow, let's check this out right here. This is called the Brown Sugar. This is what we're gonna call these. Um, it has a great look to it, if I do say so myself. Now the 998 was originally released back in 93 and it's just, just one of those staple uh, silhouettes of the brand. It has a, definitely has a little cult following. People really love them. And as I was saying, I like it because it's comfortable for me being a big guy. The shoes are wider naturally being New Balance and that just helps out with just being a comfortable shoe that you can wear all day. So another aspect of New Balance is what I like is the quality. As you can see here, hopefully it's rendering in the video. This long-haired pigskin suede is the truth. Now, if you run your finger across it, you can see it. It's color change in effect. So this is the shoe that I got for less than 80 bucks. Now, when you compare this to some of the shoes that cost 200 plus from other brands, it's not even a comparison. This is 10 times better. And uh, this is another reason why I like it. It seems to be a great value for me. So um, it's crazy how this kind of matches with the wood on the floor. But... Um, yeah, I was fortunate to great, get a great deal, like I said, on Hibbit.com. Retail price is 180 on these, and uh, it was on sale for 104 but then, of course, they had the 30% off the pre-Black Friday. So um, hopefully you guys are taking advantage of these deals that are popping up. And uh, you can follow the Retro Insider on Twitter and Instagram. I like to kind of um, shout out some of those deals and even on the podcast show and i'll put a link to that in the description so um just some initial impressions that i'll just share with you guys right now this is usually not uh a new book this is like a new book right here but it's usually not it's like plastic molded plastic on most other models so it's good to see something different there it's cool to me and then um this little strip right here this happens to be 3m Let's see, 3M on the New Balance end. Uh, that's 3M. So staying true to the running shoe heritage, that's 3M on the back part there. Of course, the mesh is legitimate here on the back heel portion. And another aspect of the shoe that's a little different is this right, the top of the toe box is all suede. Usually it's either mesh or perforated suede, but now this is just a full complete panel of suede. So that's cool, little unique touch laces look nice match the color very very well and then last but not least hopefully you guys can tell this shoe is actually lined in leather so a nice premium touch to this shoe there goes the insole there but this is the first 998 that i've had that is lined with leather so it just adds to the premium feel of the shoe um let me know what you guys oh excuse me <laughs> Let me know what you guys think about this shoe in the comments below. Are you a fan of New Balance? And if so, what's your favorite silhouette? Like I said, mine happens to be the 998. But um, later on, I'll go ahead and put a link in the description for the full detailed review of this particular shoe. And y'all can go check that out on the retroinsider.com. And also, if you're interested in getting a pair of New Balance 998s, maybe these or a different uh, pair, but don't know how they fit, check out our full size guide for the 998s. I'll put a link to that also in the description as well. Give you some of my suggestions on what size you should get depending on the type of foot you have or your foot uh, fit preference. So um, that's pretty much it guys. Great deal on these. Hopefully you guys can continue to have uh, success getting the shoes that you want for a great deal this 
holiday season and such if you're into that either for yourself or your friends or loved ones so um, until next time we'll be back with more so y'all come back now you hear <laughs> all right stay humble and proceed take care